Welcome seafood lovers to another Fishy Friday here at Bart's Fish Tales. And today we're going to make a stunning, easy, classic recipe, which is gonna be a grilled squid and a parsley garlic sauce. So the first thing you need is cleaned squid. And if you want to know how to clean squid, just click here. And as soon as you've got clean squid, you can buy smaller pieces, or smaller sized, medium sized, large sized. This is quite a large size. Uh, you really need to make sure they're really dry. So I have got a bit of kitchen paper and I just push on it, make sure it's dry from the outside. So now I've dried my squid, I'm going to marinate it in some olive oil, some salt and some black pepper. Now I've got my tubes in. This is actually the tube, this is the body part of the squid. They're quite big. I'm going to grill them as a whole, but you also could like uh, cut them in, 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 in two pieces, which would be maybe a bit more easier to fit in your pan. So I give it a toss through the oil, and I leave it there for like 10, 15 minutes. And meanwhile, I'm going to make the sauce. Okay, so for the sauce, we will need some garlic. So one nice garlic glove. Roughly chop it. And I add this to, the, to my kitchen machine, to my blender. A bit of salt. Some parsley. And I give this a stir. Great. So now I add a bit of olive oil and a bit of lemon juice. So this is the substance you want to have. Really good. A little bit of extra salt, a bit of extra pepper. sauce is ready. So I've got my grill on high heat and I've got my squid tubes here. So I start with the tubes, beautifully marinated, and I lay them down on the grill. I'm not going to touch them. So number two, the tentacles. So actually what I've got here is semi-grill, semi-plancha. So I've got my tentacles here on the plancha, but you could do it in a frying pan, you could do it on your in your grill pan. So it is, as soon as you see that the squid is a bit coming up, feel free to use a spatula and just press it down. Okay, now we're going to turn them around, flip them over. Beautiful. So I've got them like two, three minutes on each side. But mine are quite big. If you have a smaller one, reduce the time of cooking until like maybe one and a half, two and a half minutes on each side if you have the real small ones. So I think, yeah, the tentacles are done. Beautifully caramelized, properly cooked. Take them out, take them off. Great, I have a nice, beautiful plate. I give it a few more seconds. Look at this. This is really, 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 really nice. Beautiful. Squid, beautiful. And now it's time for the sauce. And the sauce is it's chilled, it's cold, but if you pour over it, it will become uh, chaired, it will become warm, which is perfect. Beautiful, the green color with it. Some lemon. So now I'm going to taste this dish. I love this way of cooking seafood. Simple, really simple. So you really will taste the pureness of the sea. Mm. It's fresh, fresh squid, shortly cooked, so you get this caramelized layer. And inside you have the tenderness and the softness. This is really well. This is pure. And, and just some olive oil, some lemon, some parsley, some garlic pepper and salt and your dish is ready. Thanks for watching. I hope you like this video. Give it your thumbs up. If you have any comments, any questions, leave them in the box down below and hope to see you soon back on another Fishy Friday. Bye bye.